Yo, what is going on people and welcome back to another video. So today we're going to be jumping in Daisy Tools and I'm going to show you guys how to create distance LODs. Now the basic rundown of distance LODs is, is the further away you go if you want to think about it, the further you walk away from that building in game, it'll somewhat display a different model there. So you're walking away and that model is getting worse and worse of quality and therefore your game will run better. This is pretty simple. If you do have any issues, please do let me know in the comments down below. Please do leave a like and a subscription. I really do appreciate it. And let's jump into the video. So remember, this is something that you will be doing once you have a model basically already imported. So I'm not going to import a model today. I've, we're going to pretend that I've already set up a model. So I'm going to open the P3D and it's going to have your model here whatever it is and it's got all its texture pass ready so everything is textured correctly make sure that everything is textured correctly this is what you will see mainly in game this lot here and it's really really simple all that you need to do to create a distance lot is right click this duplicate then head over to points merge near and click detect now select OK and then you have a disseminated model but we're gonna keep doing it we're gonna right click this duplicate point merge near and detect and we're gonna select OK again now as you can see this models kinda of going downhill now so what you're gonna do is if it's going really bad then you'll leave it. But we're going to do it once more. Duplicate. Points. Merge near. Detect. OK. And we're going to leave it at that. Now for bigger, more higher poly models, you will have to go further. Or you might want to. So you can go to 4, 5. I've noticed with most DayZ buildings, they just go to um, the number 4 LOD and then leave it at that. Sometimes I go to 3, like especially with this one. It's only 2,000 polys, so you don't need to make it go so far. But that's how simple that was, guys. I am going to come out with some more tutorials. I'm going to learn some weapon stuff. Everyone begs me, Matthew, please make a weapon. So don't worry. I'm going to learn the basics. Once I've learned the basics, I'm going to teach you guys how to learn the basics also. So do leave a subscription for that. If this video did help you out, please do leave a like and a subscription. And I'm coming back. I've got a bit of energy. Matthew Long Times here to stay. Join my Discord if you do need any help. And I'll see you guys next time. Adios, amigos.